everyone welcome back to another little week in my life uh one of my screws is missing and it keeps on flipping my camera upside down so annoying anyway it is currently what time is it it's 806 and i woke up at five ready to go to yoga and as i was like laying there i usually give myself like five minutes to just kind of hang before you know i i say hello to the world um, I started feeling awful. I've been dealing with some stomach problems. Um, if you know, you know. And I was like, I can't do this. I'm gonna miss yoga, whatever. Cancel my class, go go back to bed, wake up another hour. Like I just set a little timer for an hour. I was like, okay, 6.20, 6.20, 15 wake up time. That isn't that bad, you know? Like that's fine. I can maybe go to the gym, do the stair stepper or do a form workout since I'm missing out on going to hot yoga. Okay, I'm like fine. Wake up 620. Mm, deal almost maybe even worse than I did in the in the morning. I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna wake up at seven then. Set my alarm and I'm just sitting there waiting to get up 730, still not feeling better. It's like 30 minutes ago or so. I'm like, I'm just not I'm not feeling good. So I was like, I'm not going, I'm not going to do today, essentially. And I took my medicine this morning, all that stuff. And I was like, I called into work and now it's 8.05 and I'm like, I hate missing things. I'm going to see if I can get ready before 8.45. Anna went to Aldi and I was talking to her and she was kind of telling me, I just feel so bad, like when i'm like I, I yeah when i just miss out i guess or not not that i feel it's like a fomo thing it's where i feel like not productive which i know is like this is not healthy like i i recognize that but i'm like yes my stomach hurts but i can do it my stomach hurts but i can do it so i am going to try to get ready in 30 minutes thankfully my hair looks like semi decent i I did while I was sitting in bed just now, I did finish editing the video for this week. I've been so bad at recording and also scheduling those for uploads on Monday mornings. thought I just heard something, but it's definitely just the air settling. Anyway, I just want to start off this video saying hi, happy Monday. Um, I have work, school, and C group. So I'm gonna get ready. Fingers crossed, I can get ready in time. <laughs> Guys, it's 8.45. I think I'm gonna make it, or it's 8.46, oh no. I think I made it. I think I look cute. I feel cute. I feel ready. Uh, my stomach still, still kind of hurts, but I'm gonna go to work. I also forgot to get gas yesterday, so that's not good. Um, we'll deal with that later. Anyway, I will talk to you guys soon. Happy Tuesday. Just got back from my dermatologist appointment to talk about Accutane starting month four. And it actually took me and yeah, I stopped um, and grabbed some stuff from my parents. So I thought I would just show you because it's so cool. So the first thing, oh my gosh, this is so awesome. The first thing is a golf picture frame. I thought this was really cool. My mom sent it to me. And I think I'm gonna put a picture of Blunt and I in here and give it to him. Cause I think that's really cute. Oh, I'm obsessed actually. And then the next thing is this lamp that my mom found. It has Raggedy Ann and Andy on it. And I need a light bulb and a lampshade. And I don't even know if it works, but hopefully it does. If it doesn't, it's still like, it's such a cute little like trinket. So I'm excited about that. I think this is the last thing. My mom gave me and Anna this Snoopy blanket and it's so big and I'm gonna put it in the living room right now. That's a little haul, wanted to show. I think I'm gonna go to the gym soon and then I, I wasn't gonna go into work, but I think I am actually for at least like three hours, so. And then I'm hanging out with Mage and Ash, so. I'll see you guys later. Hey everyone. Hey guys, 
Tuesday. Major Ashley and I are making pizza right now. So here's a clip. Check of that. that. We just watched an episode of Vamp, Vamp Diaries. <laughs> Okay. All done? Yeah. Okay. All right, let's get off. Were you trying to? Yeah, I was just trying to move it up. Okay, there. It's recording. Hey guys. Okay, I'll put my keys on first. Welcome to the, to the kitchen. Will you record this? Yeah. I'm gonna try to make an aesthetic Oops, TikTok. Like just your hand? Yeah. Yummy. Okay, you can stop it. Thank you. Behind the scenes. BTS. <gasps> How are they? <laughs> oh my gosh, actually there's kind of a big K-pop scandal right now. Really? Yeah. What? So there's this like company. I don't know how much she used to do. That was really good. That's that like enough, good. you think? I think so. Okay. What company? Hive. Oh. All the stuff that's coming out about them. What's coming out? They just like shit talk everyone. <laughs> anyway. Oh. Wait, I meant for Ashley. Oh. And then you guys. working on the pepperoni. Yeah. I didn't know what you wanted. Not a lot. But it really? wasn't me. Don't be a hater. Hi Bobby Vlog. I um Omri left her camera out and so I wanted to say hi. I am sorry Aubrey I'm stealing your camera. I am finishing the show Sex in the City. I have two episodes left and I'm feeling really good about it. I also just wanted to show, it's almost Halloween. I'm wearing this thing like every day because I want to get all my wares out of it and then I can't wear it anymore after Halloween. So um, yeah, it's storming a lot in Lawrence right now um, or just the weather's been kind of crazy because there's some something going on. Um, and so I've just been kind of cozied up and watching TV all day. I'm normally not someone that likes to do that, but it's been kind of nice. I have a candle going. It's also winter time in the show that I'm watching. And so I wish it was nice and chilly here. It looks nice and chilly outside. And then I just went out to take the trash out and it was really warm. So unfortunate, but yeah, just wanted to say hi. Hi, Aubrey, I love you. Okay, that's all by vlog. Hey guys, happy Wednesday. It is Wednesday night. I'm gonna grab my trash can. Grabbing this because my lilies are like falling apart everywhere and I just need to throw them in the trash. So that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, I got them done. Hey, happy Wednesday. It is about 8.40. I just got done with like an hour of working on my thesis. I remember the last time I talked what it was about, honestly, I have no recollection. But, um, yeah, it's Wednesday today. I worked from 8 to 5 because I didn't go into work yesterday after my appointment because I had my dorm appointment, which I think I talked about, and then I had a thesis appointment, and then I hung out with Ash and Mage um, yesterday evening, which was so good. We're, I think we're approaching about halfway. Whoa, did you guys see that lightning? We are approaching about halfway through season two and we're just introduced to the originals and I'm so excited to be watching with them. They're so fun to watch with. Anyway, if you can't tell, today it started thunderstorming while I was at work. It was so dark and it was pretty cozy feeling. Oh my gosh. It's like really thundering. Um, but yeah, Anna and I went to Crunch after I got off work 
and that was good and then I had some salad and then yeah I took a shower whatever that leads us here um I do think I'm gonna read a little bit before bed I finished I got this on it might have been Friday when I took myself on a little date and went to like the toy store and then I went to Raven on Mass in, here in Lawrence and I bought this and I loved it. It was, it was a five star book for me. I finished it while I was working, listening to audiobooks. I also finished another audiobook that was The Teacher by Frida McFadden. I read it three star. It was like, it was fine. It kept me interested, but it was just so disgusting. <laughs> like, if you read it, you'll know. I'm sure you can, like, you can probably tell the premise of it so this isn't spoiling anything. But it, it, it like touches on a student having relations with the teacher. And that's just like disgusting to read about. It is a horror, so I don't know. Read the reviews, see if you want to read it. But anyway, I think before bed, before bed, I'm going to read, I'm going to start reading this. It's called The Pumpkin Spice Cafe. It's the season to fall in love and it's by Lori Gilmore, which that's like Lorelai Gilmore. And this book is, I've heard really reminiscent of um Gilmore Girls which I watched while I was in high school but pretty sure it's a series so if I like it I'll probably buy the rest of it because I think there's like one more fall book and then the rest are like Christmas-esque or they're going to be Christmas-esque and I think that'd be really cozy to read um you know throughout throughout this season I know tomorrow is October 31st and so I'm kind of reading it a little late but I think that's okay. But I think, yeah, I think I just want to read this um, to kind of unwind. Oh my gosh, it comes with a playlist and the first song is We Fell in Love in October. So that's really funny. Oh, Ceilings by Lizzie McAlpine. Cardigan by Taylor Swift. The Night We Met by Lord Huron. Oh my gosh. Wow. This playlist is honestly really good. Anyway, I'll read you guys the back. It says, when Jeannie's aunt gives her the beloved pumpkin spice cafe in the small town of Dream Harbor, Jeannie jumps up a chance for a fresh start away from her very dull desk job. Logan is a local farmer who avoids Dream Harbor's gossip at all costs, but Jeannie's arrival disrupts Logan's routine and he wants nothing to do with the irrit irritatingly upbeat new girl except that he finds himself in explicit in explicit inexplicably sorry i have my retainer in yes i'm blaming it blaming it on my retainer drawn there will genie's happy-go-lucky attitude win over the grumpy but gorgeous slogan or has the city girl found the one person in town who won't fall for her charm or her pumpkin spice lattes come on guys that sounds adorable i've heard such good things about it so i'm excited to read this but I do think I'm gonna go to bed. I'm trying to debate if I want to go to yoga in the morning or if I want to go to the gym because it kind of depends what time I'll wake up. Like if I want to go to yoga, I need to wake up at five, but if I want to go to the gym, I could wake up at six and sleep in an hour, which part of me is like, I might, I might sleep in and maybe just skip yoga this week. I think honestly think I'm feeling more inclined to do that and I think I'm gonna listen to my body I haven't been feeling the best this week it's just been an off week a little bit ago I thought I had appendicitis I don't think I do it'd be really funny if this was like subtle foreshadowing shadowing that I actually do but I don't think I do it, I'm just having some pain um but anyway before I go because I've been chatting for a while. I do want to show you guys this lamp that my mom picked up for me while I was at, or she was at a thrift store and she sent it. And I was like, please give, give that to me. And it is this like Raggedy Ann and Andy lamp. And it's just so stunning. And that is so pretty. And I found this lampshade at Target. And it is a little bit big, but I think it works. The issue is, is it doesn't sit where it needs to like it needs to sit right here but it sits like this but i i don't think that looks bad like if it if i could just get it to sit right there so 
I need to figure that out, but I, I think it's so cute. I just don't know what to do to get it there. But yeah, I found this lampshade at Target and I just thought it was so cute and fun. I honestly don't know where I'm gonna put it because Anna and I have a lamp. Like, actually in every place you could have a lamp. But like, shut up, that's like, that's too cute. I think it's so adorable. And I know the lampshade, like, it's a lot going on, but I just thought it was so fun. So, if you guys can think of a way for me to make this sit in the correct place, let me know. But anyway, I'm gonna go. Good night. Sweet dreams. Hi, everybody. Hey, people. Hey, people. Happy Halloween. It's so blurry. I just third wheeled yes. to Buffalo Wild Wings with Ann and Ethan. Oh my gosh, you literally can't see anything. It's so blurry. Hold on. Of the friendship of a boy and the two girls that yell at him. Uh, and it's like Sam and Freddie and uh, Carly and Carly. Yeah. And like Zoe 101 too. And then her friend Ryan. I don't know. Things like that. That is Mine funny. That would be a flip, but yes. In that situation, you're reminding that you're on and you're yelling at you. I got a new camera and I can't tell. I just set it up, I think. The battery is gonna die, but I wanted to try it. I think I got it. Look. That's great camera quality. It's crazy. I can't tell if it's a wider lens or not. Like, I wish I my old camera worked to where I could compare it. Yeah, you can see, you can go back and look. I almost feel like it is a little bit wider. The thing is, is it doesn't zoom in as much. Like, it does not. Um, my other one could Because it doesn't come out. Yeah, my other one probably could have, like, zoomed into, like, my eye, whereas this just zooms in on my face. Why would you want that? I mean, it was cool if I was at a concert and stuff. Like, I could oh, really zoom. Yeah. But I do kind of think it's a little bit wider. I think. I don't yeah. know. Do you show them the your broken camera? No. Do you want to get it? It's in the... It's uh, up here, Lennon. And... I haven't vlogged all weekend because my camera broke on Friday, which was Friday. I actually, it's in there. I promise it. No, no, no. I promise it's in there. It's in there. Is this? Yes. <sighs> oh, I'm looking for the pink right case. There. I had to take it off. I don't, guys, I don't know what happened to it. It's not, like, I'll show it to you. And the screen doesn't turn on. I don't know. Friday I cried for like actually an hour straight and not, like that's not an exaggeration um I don't know like this too is being weird it just it just gave out which is really sad um because I love this camera but now we have a new one I do have a wind guard thing on it which I'm scared will you put this back love thank you I do have a wind guard on it which it just came with the camera so I don't really know how that works but it is a Sony. This is the first time I've had a Sony. I just got the most affordable option. Um, and yeah, the thing is the camera like lens comes out to the side, which I think is a little bit more noticeable than when it's up above the lens. So that kind of sucks. So I'm going to have to be a lot better at looking at you versus looking at myself. But I do think it's fun. I think it is tracking my face. Like the camera on this thing is so weird, but... I'm just like looking at it right now, obviously. Hi. But anyway, I do think, I think it's a wider lens. I can't tell because the lens is so, the lens is so weird that you wouldn't think it's wider. So maybe it's not. But anyway, I'm gonna go. I just wanna say, hey, I'm gonna charge it. It's the same charger as my phone, which is interesting. But I'm gonna go. I just got back from St. Louis, which is fun. I guess it's okay that I didn't vlog. I wish I had, but it was a fun girls trip. And yeah, I need to shower. I need to do some homework. So that's update. Bye. Oh, it's so weird. The record button's at top versus 